Okay, we are now at the final, final few Tekken, you know, that we will have, because after that Tekken 8 was going to come. And there you go. So I was just, uh, <laughs> the reason why you could probably see the intro was because of, uh, because I was adjusting some of my audaci uh, audacity settings and my microphone settings. Oh no. Damn it, getting hit these over and over again. My hands are slightly cold. I pressed duck, but it didn't work. I, I was pressing duck, it didn't work. Uh, hopefully this will not be a problem in Tekken 8. Okay, so I apologize that uh, for that stupid delay that was occurring. That was basically because of the... Because I was adjusting Audacity and my camera settings as well. Now the duck worked. I have no idea. Like I have to press duck so early for it to work. Really, I've, I've basically stopped complaining. Damn it. Oh god, I forgot to follow up. Wait, that was a well standing punish, but didn't work. I didn't want to get a skyrocket on him. This is my first match today. This is obviously going to be my last um, How Wrong Wicked for Tekken 7 bec uh, because Tekken 8 is coming out. Not sure whether I'll buy it on like launch. Probably I will as I don't want to be left out, but I know the there is there are going to be problems. Like when was the last time we saw a PC game which was without without problems? When was the last time that happened? When was the last time we had a, a PC build without any problems? By the way, the exciting thing about Tekken 8 is that it, uh, 
it basically has an easier sidestep, which wasn't present, uh, which wasn't present in Tekken 7 for keyboard at least. On gamepad, it's so easy. Sidestepping is so easy on gamepad, but on keyboard, it doesn't work for some reason. I don't know, know what the reason is. Lucky guy. Oh god. Sidestep's not working. The sidestep is really not working, which is a bad thing. Whee. Okay, so this is against an old rival. Very, very good armor king player. Have to be very, very careful against him. Oh god. I had an idea I would go for a throw again, but the power crush, I was in the middle of my power crush, which is the reason why it didn't work. Great. Why am I mash mashing so hard?
The heartbeat is quite up right now. Hmm. I'm surprised he didn't want a revenge match. I don't know whether you guys will be able to see it, but my heart rate is quite high. I'm thinking that I should probably not be playing Neville Harder again. It's 100 right now, I do not know whether you guys can see it or not, but it's actually in the hundreds. Which is, I uh, think, he is back again, but you can see that the heart rate is not that good. Now it's 85, but before that it raised to 100. This is the reason why I'm thinking that I should probably quit Tekken, because my body probably cannot handle it. Because of the autism and stuff. You know, autistic individuals have a problem with these kind of situations where they know that uh, most of these, uh, you know, this game, it, it has so many flaws, it, it, it actually becomes painful to play this game at times. It doesn't, it's not fun, it becomes painful actually. Was that one plus two break? That was probably a throw setup. <sighs> okay, so I'm going to go against an Eddie Gordo, who is a second Dan, but uh, could be an, could be a player that is, um, what do you call that? Smurfing, I believe that was the correct word. I don't remember what it was, but yeah. Oh, again, I think I have a fever. I think I'm just going to... This is this, this is going to be the final... Probably going to be one of the few few matches that I'll play. Uh, from the record, it seems like this guy is new. But Eddie's can be... Even an Eddie can beat me. I'm such a bad player. Ah, oh, Cloud Physics. Oh my god, what?
Four breaks are not doing very good. I'm actually actually trying to get a counter hit on him. I really want to get a counter rate on him. Well, that was a counter hit, so... I really wanted to take him to the wall. Oh no, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> 